Why, hello everyone, and welcome back to the newest mod. This is Ataku Showboat, and last time we met, I got into upgraded robots by building batteries. And we did a whole bunch of other stuff around in the mall. Made a few missile launchers. <laughs> and guns uh the one thing i didn't make was this drone launcher which i really should have it's done in the large assembler that's a uh vehicle yeah that that's just a artillery turret drone launcher i'm sure this has yeah a range yeah 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 range huh up to 1,024. It's it's interesting. I just don't have anything to shoot with it. That's the that's the problem that uh, we are going to be attempting to address uh, today, ideally. Uh, ooh, right. Yes, I want you. I want you. I want you. I want you. Doink, 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 wait, what? You? There. You? There. Four things? Yes. Five things. Ugh. Five things. Three things? Six things. All right. Uh, hangar one. Hangar one? Really? Hangers. Where are the hangers? Hanga? Hanga? In here. Hanga one. Go ahead and, uh, get those for me. Limit that. Limit those. Don't really limit that as much. Uh, that can be limited. That needs to be very limited. Uh, input. Input, output. Input, output. Input, output. And yield, 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 yield. There we go. We're moving! We have upgraded hangers. And upgraded chargers. I really should tell this thing tell my base to upgrade all of the chargers and hangers to the upgraded hangers and chargers uh, another benefit here is that the hangers will actually hold more stuff and they'll have greater range so I have this upgrade planner we're going to do that to that and that to that and we're going to tell the whole Frickin' base. All of that. Yes, all of that. Now, everything in here can stay hangar ones. I don't really care about upgrading any of this. There's a lot of these uh, that would need to be upgraded. They can, they can stay the way they are for now. For now. Today's agenda is to work towards getting into sensor twos that is that is our to-do list we need sensor twos i need to remember to set this to auto assign where's the uh settings mod settings is it under per player for to-do list yes auto assign tasks thanks that would be ideal please auto assign tasks all right that will greatly improve things. Now, I'm going to anticipate that there are comments on the previous video, at least one at some point, telling me about the existence of mods that allow for the recall of robots. I know, and I'm not using them. Why? Because they tend to have a really, really, really huge performance impact, for one, and I would need to have them operating 
for until I get the highest level of robot, essentially, and after having completely refreshed all of the robots with that top tier of robot. Um, we're gonna do this in what's known as the old-fashioned way. Uh, after I add a whole bunch of updated bots into the system, I'm going to use filter inserters on my hangers to filter the previous tier of robot into boxes. And as they come into the hangers, they will get filtered, pulled out of the hangers. That is how that is going to work it is uh, it is something you can do yourself without needing any other mods and i'm going to do that this time and of course my preferred mod that does the recalling of bots is in fact called bot recaller and it is not compatible with the current version of the game it requires a manual set of edits uh, in order to get it working. And uh, yeah, if folks want to play along, uh, it would be ideal if they could have access to all of the same mods uh, that I'm using. So that will be how we handle things, just the old fashioned way. Now, in order to do what I need to do today, uh, I will need to go over to Titanium and take care of Titanium, but there's always a but. I can currently make, in my mall, these previous three things besides Sensor 2s. I will need to get into Sensor 2s uh, to get into the physics apparatus, to make the buildings required to get into the physics apparatus. Uh, between this and the Eutectic Salt, those are like the last couple of things we actually need before having all of the required infrastructure, or the at least the ability to build all of the required infrastructure to make physics apparatus boxes. Physics science, which is our... It is essentially the equivalent to the base game's utility science in progression, the, the yellow science, uh, in that it is the last the quote-unquote last science before launching rockets and getting space or astronomical science. Um, that That's how that uh, compares. So you could either call it the purple or the yellow science. I guess because it's a whole bunch of infrastructure, you could call it the equivalent of the base game's purple science instead. Uh, but whatever. It's a major, major, major thing. That's going to take a little while to uh, produce, and it produces as boxes out of infrastructure boxes that you then have to take to your science and uh, start doing things with uh, over there. Uh, I need to be near my epoxy, as well as near nitric acid, as well as uh, argon and compressed argon. I will need to uh, produce argon and compressed argon. And because I'm needing this uh, at the moment, uh, my thought is that actually, we're gonna do this in here, this line, I think, like right, right in here, this zone. So we're gonna have three This building cannot do this recipe. Yo, Helmod, why did you tell me that the small assembler worked for this? Huh? Okay, there we go. That might also be the case here. Oh good, you actually have uh, the thing that you need. Sure, we'll do that there, and we'll have this guy coming in over here. Yep, that will be that. 
Uh, and of course, my personal robots are now the construction bot twos, the beautiful red construction bot twos. Um, I'm gonna put a barrel pump. I'm gonna I'm gonna do a barrel pump here uh, to get the argon uncompressed. That is not required at all. There we go. Uh, and I'm going to make compressed argon and then uncompress it for the other thing. Yep. This will come over here somewhere. Ta-da. Uh, you... And you. Output, 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 input, 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 input. Please tell me it's five. It is precisely five. I'm making boxed hard glass. Uh, so I will need to unbox the hard glass. Uh, hey, buddies, how's about, uh, how's about unboxing that hard glass for me? That would be, uh, that would be great. Yeah, give me, give me some unboxed, some beautiful unboxed hard glass. That would be... Very, 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 very ideal. Uh, for the exception that I would also like to request a little bit of this hard glass box stuffs and fill that. There you go. You know what? I'll just get rid of that completely. The bot, I can do that. Go, go, go. Be free. Do the things. Uh, and you will just, ha you will just do stuff. You'll just work. Once, once the argon is added, the compressed argon, which is gonna be made over here. Distillery. Ooh. Hey, I can do that. I can do that here at the mall. I have graphite, sodium, sulfate, crushed limestone, hydrochloric acid, and the ability to make oxygen here at the mall. So there's, there's that. There's that solution. All set up, ready to go. Uh, give me the compressed residual gas into compressed argon. Give me the compressed residual gas recipe. Uh, that's going to need... Oh god, that makes four. How much do I need? 4.2? Oh my. Oh my. Uh, efficiency, please. Reduce the power draws. Negative 80%. Uh, so why do I want to do this over the other one? Uh... Well, A, because I need the compressed uh, argon, but B, this makes steam, which is incredibly convenient. It's incredibly convenient that this makes steam because then I can just vent both of these rather than having to like place shallow water and deal with the stuff there uh, from that. Uh, this is convenient because it allows me to do this this way um now if i have two of these if i want all of this eight compressed argon i will need 20 compressed residual gas 20 uh you know what let's do six let's just do six that sounds nice. Oh yes, I need a... Uh, I need to upgrade my two hangers. 
That's... Oh, that's right. I can upgrade my hangers now. Oh, boy, that's great. That's fantastic. Give me these hangers. Give me these hangers uh, because that's going to be... That's going to mean a larger robot limit, right? Would that not mean a bigger robot limit here? That would be so nice. Yeah, we need we have a bit of a lack of charging in this region. We need more charging. More charging. Yes, please. Please bring me the hangers as they're made. Uh, I have a bunch of upgrade orders. Oh boy. Hello. How much stuff do you hold? I don't think I can easily tell without physically going there. Maybe I'll pass by the robot on my way that's delivering the thing to me. I just want to have a look at uh, one of these that's placed. Here, it has three slots. <laughs> Woohoo! Three slots as opposed to two. Wow. Isn't that nice? Oh yeah, I guess I also need to upgrade my sensor ones, huh? Mine. Okay. Now to, uh... Pull that out, put that in. 16 is the robot limit on these now. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Uh, please take that away. The fu? Take that away. Okay. So now, rather than 20, I can have 32? My robot limit should be 32. Yeah, max. Excellent. I want to I want to have that. Most definitely I want to have that. Uh, I would also like to replace this capacitor with a battery, but I it I don't care actually. Uh with my way of doing things, it don't matter none. It don't matter none at all. Uh, I was over here so I could grab another 12 glorious construction bots. He says, and then he does that. Release! Unleash the bots! Thanks. Great, great, great. That also means they charge a little faster. Just, just a little bit. It's still only one. Really? It's still only one? My god, you could have given me two. You could have given me an extra charging point on these. Like, huh? That's just mean. That That's just mean. At least give me the freaking charging point. By the way, am I... I'm pretty sure I am unboxing glass fibers. Somewhere. Somewhere I think I'm unboxing glass fibers, but we, we shall see. Just add compressed argon. Okay. We're... We're good. Uh, you have... Uh, how many? One, two, three, four, five... Five solids. Uh, good. Thank goodness. That it is just... You know what? If it's all the same thing, it's super duper dumb. 
to have all those supply chests. Having all the requester chests, that's the... that's fine. Stacks, please. We deal with stacks around here. Uh, power. Uh, that's these, by the way. Uh, pretty much. And then you... We'll have your stuff there. Oh good, I do have plenty of that. Uh, there you go. That'll be the optical cable. You need some power. You will need power. Um, and you will need power. So. 100 compressed air. One of these uh, is able to make 195. I think it's going to be close enough. But, uh, yeah, 780. Divided by 150. Yeah, that's, uh, that's that. How much power did these use again? 160, huh? If I speed them, it's still not going to be enough because it's 5.2. Eh, that's fine. That makes up to 900. Uh... 750. Uh, actually, if I have two of these with a speed module, then I won't need one of them in its entirety. But then it just looks weird. Right? So. There you go. Enjoy. And then I need how many? Three? About three. Power it all. This will go down on the infrastructure when you get into filter threes, which will ideally save a lot of a lot of effort. All right, there's your compressed argon that uh, I need to bring to here. It gets uncompressed whenever it fills up to 125 units in that thing. And it gets used in here for these, ideally, at some point, maybe. Hey, we have a lamp. We have a lamp, too. It's glorious. Lamp, too. It exists. At this point. Now to add nitric acid. Uh, which way was that? Over here. Nitric. This makes a little bit of nitric. Just a teensy weensy little bit. Uh, and I need the epoxy. Now the epoxy is down over here and I can just bring that right on over. Wait, where is it? Hold up. Epoxy. There, there you are. Bring on that epoxy over here. Uh, 
Ta-da. And that is optical cable. As well as processors. Glorious, wonderful, beautiful processors. All that for freaking green circuits. And the lamp twos. Ideally. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That should just work. Although that is so much compressed argon. Wow. Why does it seem like you're having issues? There shouldn't be this many issues. Yo. Don't have this many issues, thanks. Thou shalt not have issues. I should be making eight compressed a second. That's filled its outputs. Now all that compressed realistically should be going out to here and filling this in its entirety. Oh, one is three. Huh? Wait. The what? Oh, I need two. Me oh. Whoops. I, uh... I, I need two of these machines. And it only needs 1.4. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. That explains a lot. That explains a lot, actually. Okay. Now. In order to actually make... Circuit twos. I will, in fact, get my pin back and put the infrastructure down for making this here. This is going to pose an interesting issue. And I hope you can see what that interesting issue is. That is the chlorine. The chlorine is the big interesting issue with the sensor twos. We will have to deal with the chlorine. Just straight up. Will I be doing that today? Probably not. Also, did I not, like, put my requests in for all of these? I, I did. I did put my requests in on all of these. So what's the hold? Oh, it's because I didn't actually... I didn't actually make the proper adjustments that I needed. Yeah. I didn't do the proper adjustments. What are the quote-unquote proper adjustments? You'll see. Oh, hey, I've got... Oh, and they're gonna try bringing me the things at this point. Ah, uh, that's so kind of you. Uh, allow me to please get rid of these prior requests so that I can clean out all of my prior modules. Yes, that that is needed. That is absolutely needed. Thank you for doing that and bringing me these modules as they're produced. Uh, the issue is that I need to request more than one of the individual items that would help significantly you know that would uh that would be of help 
Okay, I think that's all of those. Same with you. That would, uh... That would help as well. With, uh, speeding up, potentially, some of these. Okay. There is a bit of an issue with sensor 1s. Have I never scaled the sensor 1s? Apparently not. Yo. Just more. Give, give more. Why you no power? Power. Better. Do I have that production? No. Maybe not. I, I, I don't know. Don't think so. I think it needs more wires. Potentially. Yeah, we need more wires. More wires! More red wires. Uh, maybe more green wires. We shall see. More green wires! Go, go, go. Be free. Do the things. We need to go to titanium. Uh, that can go. That can go. Uh, I need to go to titanium. I need to get in my train. And head on over and head on over there. Bots, thank you. For being fast. Oh right, you have all those pipe twos in you. I don't need those to be pipe twos anymore. And I don't need those priority electrolyzers, but whatever. I need to uh go to titanium. If I can remember where my titanium is. It is in fact here. Go, go, go. I will, I will meet you there. We have arrived. Over at titanium. Now, initially I was thinking. Put this fluid into a train and put it onto the bus, but... Now, my thought is, because Sensor 2s produce chlorine, the in reality, I want to do this where I'm doing the Sensor 2s, which means I will instead need the rutile provided to my mall and make this stuff at the mall and preferentially use the chlorine produced out of the uh, sensor twos. Uh, the titanium tetrachloride, I just want to look at what it is in fact used for. And outside of sensor twos, it's only used in solar panel threes and in direct titanium ingots. And not even directly in titanium ingot twos so yeah that's uh that's a thing to bear in mind yeah and i'm going to need to do titanium plates and rods as well uh, i'll i'll need more nitric production but that's trivial more nitric production is very very trivial so yeah i'm in Instead, going to add a another supply station by box here. Oh, that's weird. Why did I? Why did I build like that? Hold on. Ahem. Supply station. Your position is there. I will need to make adjustments. There we go. That will work. This. There. 
actually... No, it comes from the other side. Rutile. I'm going to split here. Priority right, so I can keep making the ingots and such, but I do need rutile as rutile. Yeah, I've got a lot of ingots. Alright, locomotive. Loco list of loco motives. You're going to limit by a lot. Thing. S. Rutile. D. Rutile. Rutile. S. D. Full cargo. Circuit condition automatic. Wow, how slow is that? My goodness. Three. Wow, how poor is my rutile? Oh, I could make this in my mall. But I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. Four is already using 12? Wow. I think I want to double this. Like, I, I can double this. Oh, right. Pipe. Upgrade planner. That pipe to that pipe. That pipe to that pipe. Oh, so, so, so nice how fast those go. Oh, I'm so, I'm so happy those go so fast. Those go zooming. They're zooming! Oh, right, I don't have any of the modules. Uh, is that going to be okay? Maybe, maybe not. Oh, right, these... I also don't have the upgraded, uh... The, the previous inserter. I've upgraded inserters for you. Uh, this will be fine. It may need more water. Or it won't. Or it will not at all. See, that's that's the type of thing that I was talking about. I can now have it minus 80% as well as plus 20 speed. It's absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Uh, but that does mean it needs 360 fresh water, which, you know, that's still... Oh, only three. Three. All right, sure. That is, in fact, three as three. Okay. Now that I have extra rutile, and we're already setting our dude over there, let me go ahead and take this and define D rutile. Save that, and back to Zamal. I will see ya when I get there. I am back at the mall. Bots are delivering to me my various wonderful things. Oh, it's so beautiful. More and more and more things. Yeah. The thought has occurred to me that I will need to have methanol canisters provided somewhere on uh, on my network. Cough, cough. Wink, wink. Nudge, nudge. I uh, may be providing my methanol canisters by adjusting this build just a little bit, considering I can now import methanol, delete all of the infrastructure involved in the methanol stuff here. 
I can bring in graphite. I don't need any of the infrastructure involved in the making of the graphite. I can bring in silicon boxes for the lube. By train? I can do lube elsewhere. What am I thinking? I can do lube elsewhere. Uh, the thing with the methanol boxes, it needs benzene. And that's about it. The benzene is the easy part. To be completely honest, I've already got the methanol. I've already got the ability to make the oxygen. It's gonna be great. Gonna be great. Now, this does this process here has some implications that I'm that I'm gonna do with this. Uh, the primary implication is that I am in fact going to need to not only bring in rutile, but I will need chlorine as chlorine. And uh, that means I need to add another train station to bring in chlorine as chlorine. Which, of course, means even more train station shenaniganry and my bots will need to build said train station I shall return when the stations are built and in the meanwhile I will request the rutile and the train station has in fact been built so you are going to be M chlorine and you will bring me my beautiful dedicated chlorine from my dedicated chlorine build it's absolutely glorious i do not need that radar goodbye and i did bring in the rutile by train off screen so now what uh, i do need to pull this belt belt uh pipe down uh i'll need to just what line I'm running it down though. By one. Come on down. Come on down. Right down over here. Here? Uh, maybe down a little lower. Into this section. There we go. Right there. Huzzah. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. The, uh, the, the wonderful thing is I'm going to need to put this behind a top-up valve. Uh, it's, yeah, it's, it's great. It'll, it'll need to be behind a top-up valve. We have some productivity modules. Yes. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so for this spot, it needs to be here, meaning that's going to be the positioning across the board. There we go. Oh, really? Running low on those sensor ones, huh? Still. But you know what? As I make them, we'll be we'll be fine. Why you no go? Because I'm a dummy, right? Am I a dummy? Yeah, I'm a dummy. <sighs> because I'm a bit of a dummy sometimes. Yep. Yep. Yup. Oh, you see how much better those red Constructo bots are. Oh, it's so nice. Those red Constructo bots. Oh, they're so nice. Oh, they're so nice to have and use for all the various things. Thank you for doing stuff like that for me. Now go and perform your missions. 
Be free. Do stuff. Do things. Build. Please, build. Okay. I will need... To also deal with mineral dust, that will be output from these, by the way, but uh, that's not going to be the tricky thing. That's, that's not going to be too bad. Okay. Here. You, I will want on this line. Great. My bots will build that. Uh, how much titanium tetrachloride? 1.79. Yeah, I make a little bit more than that. Each. Uh, don't I have somewhere a, uh, thingy dealing with mineral dust? Not anywhere nearby. Alright, well then. That's interesting, because that means I also need to bring in the, uh, hydrochloric acid. Oh boy. I need you to get out of my inventory, and I need e the, uh, flotation to flotate. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Four of these make 1.53. That is fine. And I need a hydro plant. Taking fresh water to process that sludge. It makes non-existent amounts of sludge, so it will need non-existent amounts of fresh water, but hey, sure, why not? That pitfall. Vent. Hydrochloric acid. Wherever that may be. Uh, dang it, dang it, dang it. Alright, Hydrochloric, where are you? This way. Why, hello, Hydrochloric. Nice to see ya. I need you. you bots delivering things I need to request some stuff now funny thing I'm gonna do this this way one is going to re be requesting the rutile the other is going to be requesting the graphite and that's just going to be that. It's going to have to be that. Uh, now. The fun stuff shall commence. You are going to need to have all of that. But. You are also going to need to be topped up. By that, I think, I think, three of these is 672. The four of these is way more than that. So that is uh, great. Or shall I say that two titanium tetrachloride definitely uses more chlorine than what gets output from the system. That's good to know. Okay, the rutiles coming in, the graphite's coming in. 
the chlorine should now flow. Uh, bring more at a time. I need more throughput out of you. Just add oxygen. Oh boy. Oxygen. Who'd have thunk? Uh, I need eight. Oh. That's, uh... That's not much oxygen that you need. I don't know if you're aware, but that's not much. Of course. Ah, there. Ooh. Uh, yeah, go away. Like, a water well. A water well takes care of that. Great. Now just uh, hook up that titanium tetrachloride and you're good to go. Ta-da! We have sensor twos. Excellent. Excellent, excellent. All that's left, I think, is the eutectic salt boxes uh not that recipe but that recipe yeah um yeah i'm pretty sure we can do that uh actually i'm gonna do it th this way not i'm gonna do it not that recipe no 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 that recipe wait what wait Brine, CO2, and ammonia. Oh, hydrogen chloride. That uh, hit, no. Uh, I can dump. I can dump calcium chloride solution. That's what makes this a uh, better recipe uh, overall. Uh, and you can be done efficiently. Oh. Right, boxing. Uh, and you can be done efficiently. Uh, so I will need to box some crushed limestone. That's the only thing here. Or I can just deal with the unboxed eutectic. I might just deal with the unboxed eutectic. Uh, and instead say five here. Um, there we go. What do we need the eutectic for? Of course, I've mentioned before, the eutectic salt is used for the pipes, the uh, heat pipes. Uh, and, of course, there is the uh the science have i looked at the science yet no physics physics apparatus there uh we're gonna do 0.25 no we're gonna do 0 0.2 uh efficiently cough cough that's not a lot of throughput of stuff, but bear in mind, the stuff is a lot. The, uh, the, the stuff itself is, um, yeah. Is, um, yeah. Uh, that is the boxed versions of those recipes. I'd rather actually box the unboxed versions of the recipes uh huh that's the one and then that's the one so i hope you're getting a good idea here of the um intricacies involved in here I will need power pole threes, which I could make now. Pylon twos, which I am in not in possession of. I will need to make those things. But I have all of these ingredients, including the pylon ones and the power pole 
twos. Those are just being made. But you you get the uh the thing here. Oh look, explosives. Oh, oh look, methanol canisters. I need methanol canisters here. In my mall, provided. I will need to make the belt threes. I have the things that I need to make the belt threes. I will need the hangar ones. I'm making those. The missile launchers. I'm making those. Beacons. Sensor nodes. I'm making all of these things. I'm actually making all of these things. And I'm making all of these things. And all of these things except for the walls. Actually, I will need to produce walls and gates. Walls and gates. Which will need insulation, which... I'm making, which will need, ah, which will need gypsum. So there we go. I will need to make gypsum. Is two better? I don't, I don't like the thought of, uh, it's using sulfuric acid anyway. It gives me two out. And it doesn't use any lime. Outside, well, it does through the calcium chloride solution. What am I thinking? Um, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna stick with this one to get gypsum, because uh, I have the lime and I have the sulfuric acid in the mall. Uh, what else is like the that this guy eutectic boxed eutectic needed here for the thermal tank, and then. I have surge compressor twos. I have sterling ones. I, I broke down the wall. I need more wall matrix. Go. Be free. Do do stuff. Um. Okay, I think that's about as far as I'm gonna go on the breakdown of this heat pipe twos yes that is that is the other thing that needs the eutectic salt but I'm again making all of this now I believe I set a thing for the insulation I did and I have it so the the insulation exists I don't need to worry about making this insulation uh, outside of the gypsum to keep it going. The the gypsum needs to be produced regularly. I've gotten some from breaking rocks, and that was all just used making this insulation uh, that I have just made. Yeah, there's no efficiency in any of this right now. If we if we actually break all this down to the base parts, I'm sure it's actually not that much base raw materials, especially after productivity across all of the steps involved. It just piles on and on and on and on and on uh, to get into this. But uh, yeah, this is going to be our mission for next time, folks. With that... I would like to thank you all for watching. This has been Otaku Showboat. If you have enjoyed today's video, please be sure to do all of the social and engagement stuff down below. Leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe if you have not yet subscribed and hit the notification bell. Consider becoming a member of the channel by hitting the great big blue join button and supporting on Patreon at patreon.com slash Otaku Showboat if you are so inclined and able. I will be back when I am back, and I am going to see you all on the next one.